guys, welcome or welcome back. It's Buttercup here and oh my gosh, we're here with a, another shiny video and you guys, you guys know I have been working on this one for a minute. <laughs> when we had the Kitakami DLC for Scarlet and Violet, I remember being revealed Poltergeist and I just fell in love instantly. I have a very big soft spot for food themed Pokemon. I just think they're super, super cute and Poltergeist, well, it's no exception. So I decided very early on, I wanted to go for this shiny. So I started gathering my eggs and on we went. I was actually planning for this to be like the final hunt of October for the spooky months. I thought a little ghost matcha teapot, like that's so cute, you know, that would be perfect. Well, I didn't expect this Masuda hunt to end up going on for over 3000 eggs. Now I will say it's not my longest Masuda hunt I've ever done, but it is the longest hunt I've had so far in Scarlet and Violet. So it was definitely a challenge. And I was also hunting Quaxley alongside this shiny. So I think that just made the hunt feel like it was going on even longer because I was kind of going between two targets. However, I would say the wait was well, well worth it because I love this little cutie so much. And I would say it seems like you guys do too because I did get a few suggestions from you guys to go for this shiny. So I want to say a huge thank you to SR Dread, Uber, and Caffeine God all for the suggestions to go for this shiny. You guys read my mind. I think you already knew that I wanted to do this hunt. It was just too cute to pass up. So thank you all for your wonderful suggestions. Now, before we do get into the video, I want to let you guys know I will have my shiny hunting playlist down in the description as always so if you want to check out any of my past shiny hunts that one will be linked down below if you do like this video maybe consider leaving a like as it really helps out the channel and if you haven't maybe consider subscribing as i plan to bring you guys plenty more pokemon videos in the near future i am so relieved that this hunt is finished but that is the fun of shiny hunting the ups and downs the quick hunts and the long hunts that's what makes it so exciting so i am very very glad to bring this hunt to you guys today and with that i'm gonna cut the rambling there let's get into the video Wait. <gasps> Shiny Poacher guys, let's go! <laughs> oh, oh, I thought I could tell the difference. Is it the lighting? Is that what it is that threw me off there? Oh, wow, it's it's kind of more subtle than I was expecting, but dang, Shiny Poacher guys, finally. Just over 3,000 eggs. I think this is just under 3,100 eggs. If if I'm mathing right right now, which I might not be because I'm a little bit tired. It's pretty late right now for me. Shiny Poltergeist, you guys, this this has been a struggle hunt for me. I have been doing this via Masuda method. I don't have the shiny charm, but I have been using a foreign ditto to try and get this thing. And as I said, we are over 3000 eggs. Like it's not my longest Masuda hunt. My longest was definitely the Rock Rough. That was... That was brutal, I'm not gonna lie. I was a little bit worried that we might, <laughs> we might be heading there with this hunt. But um, some of you guys will know, I was actually also hunting at the same time as Poltergeist Quaxley. And I was kind of, you know, doing a few boxes of Quaxley and then I was doing a few boxes of Poltergeist. And I think that during um, October, I just kind of went nuts for like a few days in a row where I was just focused on getting the Poltergeist and it was not wanting to sparkle. So I decided to take a little break and focus uh, back on the Quaxley. And luckily you guys might remember in the stream, we did actually get that shiny. Oh, and now what's this? Not too much long after we finally get the Poltergeist. I love this little cutie. I already love Poltergeist and Sinisty. So when I saw that they were announcing this Pokemon for the DLC, I knew that it was going to be one of the first Pokemon I was gonna have to hunt and honestly I started this hunt pretty early on after the DLC came out it's just I I was having a hard time getting it so I'm so so glad that we have this cutie I believe this is the counterfeit form that I've been hunting I really really don't mind 
I'm just so glad that we got it. Oh my goodness. I was going to say time to check the gender, but Poltergeist doesn't have one. That's <laughs> that's completely fine. Oh my goodness. Let's get another look at this thing. Okay. I feel like I feel like it might be the time of day, which is where or why I couldn't really tell the shiny, at least not immediately, because looking at it here on the screen, I can definitely see the difference and I love it. I think it looks so, so cool. Very fitting for this Pokemon. But now it is time for that nature guess. And honestly, I'm torn between wanting to say sassy or naughty i don't know why i'm feeling the why at the end i don't know I, listen guys i'm super super tired <laughs> so i feel like that's the best i can do i've got my little nature list up so i don't just pick gold again so my guesses are sassy or naughty and it is it's naughty okay oh my gosh that worked me up <laughs> Naughty nature. Very, very nice. It's somewhat vain. Oh my goodness. I am, I am very, very happy about that. What an absolute cutie. Naughty, shiny poltergeist. I love this shiny. I think it's a nice change. Now that I can see it a bit more clearly, I just, I think it's super, super fitting. And it's got the terra type grouse, which is also really cool to know. So, oh, I feel so good to have this hunt done. <laughs> now I think it is time to throw our little matcha pot out into the overworld. Yeah, like, just looking at it, it looks super, super subtle in the overworld. I'm guessing it's the time of day, but even though it is like a pretty subtle change, at least in the overworld, I think it's a very fitting change. I mean, I don't know what else they could have done, in my opinion, to make this a more fitting shiny for this Pokemon's theme. And I mean, I think the thing that really sells me on this is just like its face. I love Poltergeist, Poltergeist and Sinistee's face. I think it is so, so cute. The little spooky ghost that resides in it. Like, I just love it so, so much. And I'm really glad to finally cross this shiny off the list. It is just, uh, it has been a goal, guys. And I'm glad, I'm glad we did it. Oh my gosh, I can actually see my character in the screen. This is, I don't know if this was meant to happen or not, but yeah. <laughs> Here we are on the Pokemon picnic with our shiny poultry, guys, which like I said, whenever you get really close like this, you can definitely see the difference, but from far away, I'm definitely squinting. <laughs> However, I think once again, as I've said, it's a really great shiny. I think it fits the theming really, really nicely. And honestly, as far as the new DLC Pokemon go, I think this might be my favorite, although Oh, I say that, but then I really do want to go after Diplin as well. So I'll, I'll say it's definitely in my top three. But before I wrap up the video, I want to let you guys know I will have my shiny hunting playlist in the description. So if you want to check out any of my past shiny hunts, I will have that one down below. If you do like this video, maybe consider leaving a like as it really helps out the channel. And if you haven't, maybe consider subscribing as I plan to bring you guys plenty more Pokemon videos in the near future. This hunt, while it was challenging, it was honestly a lot of fun and I feel so... I feel so happy to finally have gotten this shiny and that's kind of the fun thing that I do really love about when hunts do go for a long time. In the middle of them it's definitely a test of patience but once you finally get those sparkles it is always so so worth it and this hunt was no exception. But that is going to be it from me today you guys. I'm wishing you all the luck on all of your shiny hunts and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! <laughs>